Welcome to our lesson on plotting cubic graphs. So we're going to plot the equation y is equal to x cubed. And to do this, we need to remember that a coordinate pair is made up of an x and a y value. So we will begin with x equals 0. So this will be y is equal to 0 cubed. So when x is equal to 0, y will also be equal to 0. And we can plot this point at the origin. And the next one, x is now 1, so our x coordinate is 1, and y is equal to x cubed, so y is also 1. So when x is 1, y is 1, and we can plot this point here. And the next one, we know our x value is now 2, our y value is y is equal to 2 cubed, which is 8. So when x is 2, y is equal to 8. And this point goes here. And when x is equal to negative 1, we have negative 1 cubed. So we have negative 1 and negative 1. And this point will go here. When y is equal to x, which is negative 2 cubed, y will equal negative 8. So our coordinate is x equals negative 2 and y equals negative 8. So this coordinate would go here. So to plot this graph, we're going to join these points together with a smooth curve. And now we can use this graph to solve the equation 5 is equal to x cubed. So we have the equation y equals x cubed. And we're using this to solve 5 equals x cubed. So we can see that y must equal 5. So we need to draw the horizontal line y equals 5. And where the two lines cross will be our solution to the equation 5 equals x cubed. We'll draw a vertical line from the intersection to the x-axis. And you can see the solution to x is approximately 1.75. So x is approximately 1.75. Okay, let's move on to the next question. So do you want to try this question yourself by plotting the graph of y is equal to x cubed minus 5 on these axes by pausing the video and then you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, so we have y is equal to x cubed minus 5 and I'm going to begin by plotting when x equals 0. So y is equal to 0 cubed minus 5. y will equal minus 5. So our coordinates are 0 and minus 5, which are here. And then we have y is equal to 1 cubed minus 5, y is equal to 1 minus 5, y is equal to minus 4, which is here. And next we have y is equal to 2 cubed minus 5, y is equal to 8 minus 5, y is equal to 3. So this point will go here. When x equals negative 2, so y is equal to negative 2 cubed minus 5, y is equal to negative 8 minus 5, y is equal to negative 13 which goes here. And finally, y is equal to negative 1 cubed minus 5, y is equal to negative 1 minus 5, y is equal to negative 6, which goes here. So now we can plot these points together with a smooth curve. 
Okay, so we have plotted the graph and now we can use this graph y is equal to x cubed minus 5 to solve the equation 3 is equal to x cubed minus 5. So you can see that the y must be equal to 3. So we'll draw the horizontal line y equals 3. So here's the line y is equal to 3 and you can see the two graphs do intersect and the point at when they intersect is when they are equal to each other and by drawing a vertical line down you can see that x is equal to 2. So x is equal to 2 when y is equal to 3. Thank you very much for watching, I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.